Hey guys, welcome back to my channel, welcome back to Anna's Period Talk. So, today is going to be the start of my period vlog. I have not officially started yet. I thought I started this morning. I woke up and I felt some cramps, but after that it was like nothing else. So, I woke up for no reason this morning. I could have went back to sleep because I woke up like at 7, a little before 7. And it's Saturday. I don't need to be up early. So, um, yeah, this is the start of my period vlog. I'm dressed to go to town. Um, me and my mom has to go grocery shopping. Well, mainly I'm going with her. I always go with the grocery shopping. I guess I try to learn so when I live out my own, on my own in a few years, I do the same thing she does. So, I always go with our helper and all that. We, we usually leave by now, but it is raining and everything, and it's like nasty weather outside, so we've been trying to wait for the rain to slack up. But my mom made breakfast. We had pancakes and sauce. So we got full belly to go to town, so you won't go to town hungry, because we have to go to the grocery store, and the grocery store that I go to, they have like a deli, and you can smell all like the chicken and all that cooking, and sometimes we go there hungry, so. At least we have a full stomach to go to town with, so we don't feel as bad. Um, yeah. Also, I did not wear tampons last month. I am planning on trying them this month. Last month, my period, like, I don't think it has to be heavy or nothing for me to really wear tampons, but any day that I was planning, planning on wearing tampons, it wasn't, like, the perfect... Mainly, I just got them for the try when I'm going swimming. Like, if I'm on my period, I want to go swimming... That's mainly what I got them for. Like, I'm not going to wear them, like, all the time. I still like pads. Like, pads are very uncomfortable, but, like, I'm still going to wear pads. Mainly the tampons just for when I go swimming or whatever, but I will try. I heard, I'm just wondering, my Nana says something about we might go swimming one day this week if she's off, but I'm not really sure. She told me that one time, and she don't really know if she has any days off next week, so really don't know, and if my period starts, like, tonight, tomorrow, or something like that, I'll have my period most of the week, next week, till Saturday, Friday, Saturday, that's when I don't start, I stop bleeding, so, I'm gonna try my best to try wear tampons this month, try them anyways, um, but basically right now, it's pads, I got pain liner on, so if I start while I'm in town, I have a pain liner to keep me covered for a while, um, because when I first start, it really don't start heavy. As it, as it goes on, it gets heavier. But for like a, about an hour or so while we're in town, if I start, pan liner ain't gonna hurt nothing. So I can put on the pad when I get home. Or if I just start and I have to use the bathroom, I do have pads in my purse to help as well. So yeah, that is really the update right now. Um, yeah, it is raining. We are, I don't live in Louisiana, but if you live in Louisiana, you know, y'all are getting affected by Hurricane Barry right now. They just upgraded to a hurricane, like, about an hour ago. Um, by the time y'all guys are seeing this, it's probably just a rainstorm. It's probably no actual storm storm to it anymore. But, where I live, we're getting the rain off of it, so that's where all this rain is coming from. But we're not getting much wind or nothing, it's just mainly rain. And it's been raining, like, most of the night. It's supposed to rain all day, and probably all day tomorrow, too. So, yeah, so that's pretty much it for right now, and I'll talk to you guys whenever my period starts. Alright guys, so, it is the next day. As you guys can tell, you don't look like I've been awake that long. It is 7.30, the last of 7.30, around that time now, the next morning, Sunday morning. I have started to have cramps. I haven't really started bleeding yet, but I know it's like actual cramps, so I just came to the bathroom. I put my pad on. If you hear coughing in the background, that's my dad. He's been coughing a lot lately. We don't know if it's something whatever it is. Um, he's in the living room. But anyways, so I put a pad on. I'm going to go eat something, drink milk or whatever. Me and my dad's the only one awake right now. I've been awake since like 4.30. I woke up. I didn't have no cramps at that time, but like I just woke up and I couldn't go back to sleep. I've been up for like four, about three, four hours now, so... Yeah, I'm going to go eat something or drink milk or whatever and get some medicine in my system. As I said, my mom is still asleep. She's still in bed. Leave somebody sleeping in this morning. 
Um, so, yeah, I'll update you guys later. Um, the reason why I'm in my bathroom talking because my door to my bedroom is open. I don't my dad hear me. So I'm just talking to you guys in my bathroom. Um, but, yeah, so that's really it for right now. I'm hoping cramps won't be bad, bad. Um, I've been as like, usually early in the morning my cramps are bad. Mainly my stuff in my lower back hurts. During my PMS time, mainly my lower back has been hurting. Um, I'd rather deal with a little bit of that pain than cramps in my stomach. So, yeah, I'm going to take ibuprofen. Um, and then, yeah, I have some coffee. I'm drinking some coffee, so warm stuff in my stomach helps. If it gets worse, I do have a heating pad that I can put on my bed and lay down on it, um, but right now I'm good, so I'll talk to you guys in a little bit. Alright guys, so it's a little while later now, um, it's about to be 10 o'clock, super glare. If you hear noise in the background, my parents have a movie on, and it's like really loud right now. So, um, yeah, I'm cramping very bad right now, I have a heat pad on me, I just turned it on. It wasn't bad earlier, went back when I first started, but I'm getting a little bit heavier, so it's getting worse pain. I have me some breakfast, um, biscuit and sausage. I have to turn on my computer and maybe watch like something on YouTube or something to try to get my mind off of it while I'm eating. I still have like an hour or two before I can take anything. Probably about 11.30, that's when I can take some more. But the bat. The problem is, I don't have any more. Like, I only have like one ibuprofen left. We didn't get none yesterday. And my parents, they have Tylenol. I can take that. But like, it don't do me good. It kind of does. It kind of don't. Um, so, I don't know. It just depends on how I'm feeling in about an hour. If I take anything or not. I might wait till after we get some ibuprofen because it's going to town me sometime or another. So, yeah, I'm going to eat my breakfast and I'll talk to you guys in a little while. Okay, so I thought I wasn't really doing nothing today, which I didn't have to go. I'll tell you guys in a minute. Um, but my stomach still hurts. It's like 10, it's been about 20, 25 minutes since I last like, picked up the camera and talked to you guys. But my mom just called, which is my mom's mom. She lives with my granny. And my granny really won't drive anymore, so they were going into town today um, to get groceries and all that. I told my granny, I was like, well, if, you know, I, it's the summertime, I'm free, you know, I would like to go with y'all, you know, I can get out of the house some, you know, and all that, like, go with y'all and, you know, help y'all out with groceries, like, help you bring in the groceries when y'all get home and all that. So, I guess it was like a last minute decision, they're going to town. And my stomach hurts, but I said yes. Um, so, yeah, my Nana called. She actually called my phone, but my phone was in the living room. I didn't have it in my room with me. Yeah, I had hair in my mouth. Um, but I really don't know what time they're going to be here. She said sometime in a little while, but a little while can be and still an hour from now, or it can be like 45 minutes from now. So, I might as well start getting ready and then lay on the heating pad a little bit more after I get ready. So I, all I have to do is pick up my purse, get my shoes on, and head right up. I'm hoping my cramps will be done by then. Um, I'm going to see if I can maybe take some medicine before I leave, just in case it hasn't stopped or you guys don't start back up again while we're in town. Um, so, yeah, I need to find something to wear, which I'm not going to wear nothing fancy or nothing. It's just going to be like a nice t-shirt with shorts, capris or something. Um, I gotta brush my teeth, I got to brush my hair. Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah. So, pretty much, um, that is mainly it. Uh, let me find something to wear. Okay, so I gotta get my bra out. This gray shirt. Mm 
I just gotta find me some pants now. I don't know, but I'm gonna go lay on the heating pad a little bit more because I just had a painful wave of cramps. Then I'm gonna get dressed. So, yeah. I'll come back before I leave. I'll um, tell you guys what I wore. What I'm wearing. So. Alright, guys. So it's a little while later now. I told you guys I will update you guys whenever I got dressed. But I. Yeah, I was in a brush. I didn't have time to film at all. Like, I got on the heating pad for a few more minutes. I let my mom run my lower back, and my lower back was hurting really bad as well as my stomach. Um, I tried doing that. I came back to the bathroom, tried to use the bathroom, because sometimes using the bathroom helps sometimes. And while I was using the bathroom, my, I heard a honking horn. My non and my granny were here, and I wasn't even dressed yet. <laughs> so, like, I was pro I knew I should have got dressed right after my mom said they called. So, like, if I was using the bathroom, I could have just got up and, you know, to do and, you know, get my purse, get my shoes on, and head straight out the door. But, I, let me tell you guys, I got ready within, like, three freaking minutes. Like, I got off, I got off the commode. I, uh, I changed my shirt. I'm still wearing the same shorts, which, like, I wear them as pajamas too, but like it can be perfectly good day shorts as well. Changed my shirt, so I wore this shirt. Put a bra on, put the shirt on. Brush my hair. I didn't have time to brush my teeth this morning. It, don't worry, I'm gonna brush them good tonight. But I really, I just didn't have time. You know, I had time. Like my gray and my non weren't really in a hurry. But like I knew they would get one go ahead and go around town. I just don't want them to be waiting on me. My mom went out there talking to him for about me a few minutes, um, so it was okay, um, but, yeah, so, it is now about to be 6 o'clock at night, we just got home, um, we went and grocery shopping all that time, by the way, I went straight to my granny's house, right after, um, right after, cause my mom was going, me and my mom was gonna go out there anyway, like, later today, but since I was already with them, I just went to my granny's house with them and my mom came and I just came back with my mom so um yeah we have pizza for lunch um so yeah cramps right now I actually took two ibuprofens about over an hour ago now about an hour ago so like I'm good until I take some about 9 30 10 o'clock before I go to bed um I took a like a little about 4 30 so I'll be good um, I am going to be trying these bad boys out tomorrow. Uh, I want to make sure I'm good and heavy, you know, good on my period. I'm probably good and heavy right now, but I'm just going to wear, I'm just going to try one of these tomorrow. I actually already have, like, a package opened. Um, like, one already, I, I was trying to do, see how I should do it, because I have no idea, like, how this freaking thing is supposed to go in? Um, but there's like instructions in here, so like, plus I asked my mom, she's like, did you read it? Like, when she had a period, she don't have a period anymore, because she takes birth control and stuff, and makes don't have a period. Um, anymore. Unless she goes past a certain time not having her birth control, then she'll get her period, but since she has her, um, gets her birth control every three months, you know, you don't. She don't get one, but she says she always used tampons when she had it. She was like, that's all I did. I read the direction, and that's how I followed it. I was like, okay. So, I'm trying this bad boy out tomorrow. See how I like it. Um, I'm not going swimming this week because my Nana has to work mostly every day, or she don't. She has to go, she has to do, like, really big things when she don't have to work. So, I don't see us going swimming this week. Which that would have been a good thing to try when I was actually going to swimming because it actually got me more productive to actually try it. But, um, I am going to try it tomorrow. I'll probably put it in after I wake up. Or a little while after I wake up, change my pad and put that on, put that in. Then put a panel liner on my panties. So, um, yeah, that's mainly what I'm going to do. I'm going to try it tomorrow. I'm just going to try it once. Um, then when the hours comes up on it, I'll check it, I'll take it out, and, um, I'll put a pad back on, or I might put another one in, you never know about me, um, depends on how I like it, um, I don't like wearing a pad, so, like, it'll be super good, because sometimes pads are, like, 
a little more expensive than freaking tampons. Like some of them are. Like if I get like the off brand pads, not like the store brand or the off brand, whatever. Like it's not as bad, but like it feels like three dollars and something. Cause this is about four dollars. Like this is you buy Kotex, so you know it's the name brand. Um, so you know it's gonna be a little more expensive. But like it's it's a girl product. Girls need it. You know, at some point in their lives they need it. So it's a necessity. But um yeah, I'll be trying those out. I'll film up until after I try my tampon. I'll give you guys my little experience. Um, like a full video, like telling you guys about how my full experience was wearing them most of the day. Um, just in case there's people out there that are debating starting them or not. So, I'll give my full experience about that in the video. But, yeah, I'm going to try it tomorrow. I'm actually going to try it. I'm going to try my hardest to gear up to it anyways. Um, so I was trying last month. I actually had a person comment on my what kind of like my tampons I'm gonna finally start wearing tampons I'm gonna finally start trying tampons and somebody commented um I forgot who the person was like have you tried one yet I commented I said no it, things didn't go cause it really wasn't heavy and like I just didn't want to because I really wasn't feeling that great um because you know if you tune in um to last last month you know, I got three teeth pulled, and I was, like, recovered from that also on my period at the same time, so I really went up to it. Um, but, yeah, so, that's pretty much it for the update right now. And I'm going to get on my computer for a few minutes, and I'm going to hop in the bath. I feel like soaking in a hot bath, you know, make my lower back and all that feel better. So, yeah, I'll talk to you guys probably before I go to bed. Or if I don't, I'll see you guys in the morning. Good morning. You don't know yet. Um, it is Monday morning now. Um, today, what time is it? It is 8.18 in the morning. I just woke up about a few minutes ago. Um, I had the best freaking sleep last night, to be honest. Um, the past few nights, I haven't really slept well or slept in. Um, but last night, I guess it's because I took like a 24 hour sinus pill because my sinuses were kind of messing up. I took that and two ibuprofen. Um, so that probably like really helped me. Sometimes when you take a sinus pill at night, I sleep very well. Um, I first woke up a little after six, but I was like, nope, I'm not getting up. Um, you never get it. I am going back to sleep. I woke up a little after 7, and I woke up a while ago, now it's a little after 8, so, yeah, um, I think my mom's awake, I hear the fan going in the back, in the back of the house, I can still hear the fan, so, my dad's probably still in the bed, which I've heard him, um, coughing, sometimes, like, when I get up, the past few hours, I kept hearing him cough, he's sick. I'm not really sure what we have what he has. Um he's coughing a lot, you know, he has some body aches, but the body aches that he's having, he said it might be like the flu or something, because you know you have body aches when you had the flu. But he's been coughing so much that like he's really, really sore from that. So it could be the soreness of him coughing a lot. Making him have like little body aches and sore and stuff um but we don't know but we gave him we got him some medicine yesterday so we've been taking that so hopefully he'll start to feel better today's monday he's not going to work um basically he works outdoors and it rained most of the weekend so he really so they really can't get in so they were not going to work today anyway but he wouldn't go to work today since he felt so bad um yeah, hopefully he'll start to feel better. Um, I feel fine. Um, I'm hoping he don't have nothing, like, contagious or nothing. Hopefully it's just, like, a little mini cold or sinuses making him do all this. Um, because if, knock on wood, if I think, and I was around him, like, a few days when he started not feeling well, unless I have a high immune system, I haven't got it. As far as I know, my mom hadn't got it either, so if it was like something like the flu, we would have got it probably by now.
Probably. I haven't talked to my mom this morning, so I, I, she's coughing a little bit, but that's normal for her. Um, she sneezed, that's normal for her because her sinuses are really bad. But I'm really hoping that whatever my dad has, it'll like blow over and we don't get it. Um, but yeah, so I'm just gonna chill out my phone as I said. Um, I think my mom's awake, but my dad is not. So I'm just chilling out of my room on my phone. Um, I decided to go ahead and just get up now. I might just watch a few videos on my phone or watch Netflix or something. Um, but yeah, my cramps are kind of hurting me right now. Um, that's what happened on the second day. My pain really ran down my system, so it's not bad, bad. So I'm not really gonna worry about it. <sighs> Let me tell you guys. Let me tell you guys. Real quick. Yesterday, I already told you guys that I had like rush when my granny and daughter got here because like I wasn't even dressed. I was just in the bathroom and all that, but. I was hoping that my cramps were really, really stopped. I told him, I had to go tell my granny, I don't like going to Walmart, you know, I feel like I'm fine, but I'm actually like in pain from cramps, but my cramps actually subsided. Um, it took a little while, but like, it, as soon as I got in my granny's car, like we just to go to town with them, like it, it started like easing off, so that's good. Um, but yeah, pretty much. So that's all I have to update you guys on right now. Yeah. And our neighbor is making noise outside. Uh, our neighbor has like tractors and stuff like that. It's the first part of the week. He's going to be making racket all day. Because he has tractors. He works on stuff in his yard. And he'll be loud and stuff all day. But anyway, so I'll talk to you guys a little bit later. Um, as I said, I will be trying tampons today. I will give you guys my little experience. Um, I might end it here. I might not. It just depends on. I want to try to get this video up early today, not late in the afternoon. Um, because some of my viewers might be around the world. Which anybody can watch my videos at any time. But I like to get it out early just in case people like my videos out early. In case you're like living somewhere besides the United States and you don't know um I just don't know the time I just don't know the time for people so I like to get my videos out kind of early in the day where most people are like awake okay guys so yeah, I am so fixing to do it I am fixing to try tampons for the first time um so I'm gonna get one out and turn on my light it's terrible um but I'm just gonna try it. I already opened the package because if you guys didn't um, see the other day, I told you guys I already opened the package, but I haven't. Like, so this is the one I'm putting in. And just in case you skipped, these are the U by Kotex ones. Um, I'm just saying to try it, and I'll tell you guys how my experience are. Plus, I will do like a full experience video to you guys about how throughout the day of me wearing it, how do I like it, if I'm going to wear more of them, all of that. So, yeah, I, it's time to change my pad anyway, so why not go ahead and put one in, then in several hours when it's time, I'll take it out. Cause I'm not going to try wearing them at night yet, I'm just going to wear them like once during the day, it'll last most of the day, and yeah, so I'm visiting to try it. Um, so yeah, I need to find the instructions, <laughs> but, um, yeah, so I'll tell you guys in a minute how, how it feels, um, after I put it in, um, also the next clip will be my last clip for this vlog because I have to start editing it so I can get it up at a decent time today, so, yeah, see you guys after. Okay, I just put it in, for the first time it feels weird, um, you can still feel it with like if you if you're doing it for the first very time, you know you still feel it some you know so you can know what's in there. Um, it took me about ten minutes or more to do it because like I called my mom back here and you're like giving me step by step how to do it even though I read the directions but I still need like guidance from my mom since she's the one that uses them. 
I didn't use the purple one since the purple one is already open and exposed for a while. My mom said I need to like open another one, so I got the pink wrapper. And it's pink, where the thing was. Um, so yeah, pretty much. Um, now I am going to go lay down, or right, just sit down, and just start editing this video. I'll give you guys my full experience about it. It depends on how it this time goes. Um, it's about two or three hours, my mom said. We need to change it just to see how it does. Um, then, like, after, I might put a pad on it. It depends on how my experience goes in the next two or three hours. I might put another one in. You never know. So, yeah. So, that is basically it for this period of vlog. I hope you guys enjoyed. As I said, be about next week or something, I'll do, like, a experience video. So, um... You guys will know how the experience went and everything, so be expecting that next week. And I will see you guys in the next video. Bye, everybody.